please pause for a moment of silent reflection. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Jaguars, and welcome back to another exciting edition of the Webridge Middle School Morning News. I'm Madeline, and alongside me is is the amazing Hosty. Good morning, Jaguars. We hope y'all are having a fantastic Valentine's Day to get today. That's right, Hosty. For for those of you who may not know, Valentine's Day is an unofficial holiday celebrated on February 13th dedicated to celebrating friendship and appreciation the strong and kind ladies in our lives. It's the perfect time to show some extra love and gratitude to your besties, your ride or die crew, and all the amazing women who make each day bright, brighter. Absolutely. Valentine's Day is all about uplifting and empowering one another. It's about cherishing those special bonds of friendship and recognizing the incredible support system we have in each other. So Jaguars, take a moment today to reach out to your gal pals, whether it's with a heartfelt note, a small gesture of kindness, or simply spreading some quality time together. Let them know just how much they mean to you. And remember, Valentine's Day isn't just about celebrating friendship, it's also about celebrating the strengths, resistance, and kindness that women bring to our lives every single day. So let's make today a day filled with laughter, love, and appreciation for the phenomenal woman in our lives. That's all for now, Jaguars. Thanks for tuning in to our Jaguar Morning News. Have a fantastic Valentine's Day, and remember, stay awesome. Bye for now, Jaguars. See you next time. What's your name? Uh, Miss Cornegay. So it's Valentine's Day today, and um, let's show some support for your friends. So um, how do your friends support you when you're down? Oh, well, I can just call a close friend that I have, or I call my daughter who works here and unload on her with what, what's bothering me, and then she always makes me laugh. So she's my Valentine, I guess. What's your name? Miss Perkins. Um, when was it, when was there a time when you, your friend gave a very heartwarming gift to you? Um, one time I was sick and my friend brought over snacks so I wouldn't have to cook, which was very nice. Thank you. What's your name? Emily. What makes a good friend? Someone that is that cares for you and has your back. Thank you. Today, we're going to have another game show, of course. And so, question one, Mr. to the Irvins. What is your spouse's favorite dessert? Got it. I almost have it. And show your boards. She's not a visit person and pumpkin pie. Pretty much. How about you? Yeah, great. Okay, you You're each get one point. All right, are you ready for question two? Yes. All right, what's your spouse's favorite vacation spot? Two points. Okay. Next question is, who's been your favorite pet? Make it a bit tougher. So. 
Okay, got it. All right. Yeah. Three, two, one, show. I think three pets in our marriage. Yeah. And our current dog, Remy. Yeah, that's our favorite. Nice. Is there a, like, is there a prize so far? You guys are like, tied at three. I mean, there's a prize at the end. Like, yeah. I mean, this is great. Wow. All right. The last question. Let's see. What's your your spouse's favorite period to teach? Oh, this is getting messy. Okay, I've got it. One, two, three. For your compass? I said all of them. Oh. For yourself. Yes, how about for you? Oh, all of them too. All of them too. Oh, well. My mistake. You missed one point. <laughs> all right, thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. All right, so we are now, so now that was the end of Know Your Boo with the Urban. Eighth grade dance. Save the day, April 12th. Hey guys! So the Walk for Water is coming up, and so please stop by the seventh grade hallway and buy a ticket to win in the raffle for the seventh grade Walk for Water. Thank you, and have a great week. And this is for the whole week, guys. To WBM students for Miss Baginski, Miss Parson, and Miss Ramsey. Thank you so very much for the beautiful cards and thoughtful words showing your appreciation during National School Counseling Week. It is a pleasure to be your 6th, 7th, and 8th grade counselors at Webridge Middle School. We absolutely love supporting you. Hey Webridge! Did you know that our school now has an official Instagram account? There are a variety of activities and events at our school that a lot of people might not know about. So, if you want to keep up with the happenings here at WebBridge, be sure to go follow web underscore bridge ms on Instagram. Thank, Thank you. you! Walk some water. Walk for water, March 3rd. Have you signed up yet? If not, make sure you zap this QR code, get your t-shirt, get signed up. We want to see you there. <sighs> PTA Music Bingo and Pizza Party. WBMS PTA presents Music Bingo and Pizza Party. Wednesday, February 28th, 4.15 to 5.45 p.m. WBMS Cafeteria, cost $5. Music Bingo is just like traditional bingo, but we play a part of a song and the kids try to guess the name and find it on their Music Bingo card. It's sure to be an afternoon of fun with their friends and a chance to win some awesome prizes. For only $5, they will enjoy a slice of pizza and a drink and receive two music bingo cards. If they're still hungry, they can purchase a slice of pizza, a drink, or candy for only $1. WBMS Track and Field for 7th and 8th graders' time trails will occur on March 13th and 14th until 5.15 p.m. Students are encouraged to attend both days. Practices will occur on Tuesdays after school. The Fulton County Middle School track meet will occur on April 20th at Milton High School. All paperwork and forms must be submitted to www.rank1.com in order to try out. Guess a black history figure. Are you ready? Let's play. This figure was not only a poet, but also a singer, dancer, actor, and a civil rights activist who wrote the quote, my mission in life is not merely to survive, but to thrive, and to do so with some compassion, some passion, some humor, and some style. Who's the black history figure? The correct answer is Maya Angelou. This black history figure was famous for writing the, the book series' first book, including the books The First Book of Negroes, 1952, The First Book of Jazz, 1955, and the first book of Negro folklore, 1958. The answer is Langston Hughes. Who is a black history figure? He wrote a speech and announced it to everyone that gathered around him on August 28, 1963. He, he has a special day meant just for him. The answer is Martin Luther King. Who is a black history figure? He, she was enslaved, escaped, and helped others gain their freedom as conductor of the Underground Railroad? The answer is Harriet Tubman. Who's a black history figure? He served as the U.S. Marshal for the District of Columbia. He embraced the women's rights movement, helped people on the Underground Railroad, and supported anti-slavery political parties. 
The answer is Frederick Douglass. Thank you.